Good day everyone, this is another one from the archive, it's the Tone Pad Pulsar based on the Electro Harmonics Pulsar from the 70s, um, it's probably about the 6th or 7th guitar pedal that I built. It does have one issue, um, it's quite renowned for having LFO ticking both when the effect is on and when the effect is disengaged and it might make it unusable particularly for recording if you're going to use it for a recording um, and you may even have issues with it live if, you're, um, if your amp's turned up quite loud you might be able to hear the ticking come through. Uh, it's a bit of a shame because the actual the actual sound of the tremolo is quite nice and um, uh, if it didn't have that ticking problem it would probably be probably, probably be on par with the tremulous loon uh, but because it has that issue if you're looking into building a tremolo and you're trying to decide between those two I'd probably just say go with the tremulous loon um, because that the ticking having that sort of LFO ticking is um, it's a bit of a turn off unfortunately. I did a couple of mods. Um, one of them is the rate pot mod. Uh, you can see this, um, the schematic and how to do that if you go to TonePad and check the comments. Someone in the comments has, um, has offered the, uh, the solution to that. And I've also um, put a, um, uh, a wired the LFO up to the LED on the front here um, so that the LED will flash in time with the LFO as I've done with some of my other builds. So to do the mod, the quickest way is if you just go to do it yourself stompboxes.com and do a search for the thread with the title Tone Pad Pulsar Rate LED question mark how to question mark and in there uh, a user named Oscar has provided a small little uh, little circuit that you can tap into the collector on Q2 with the 2N5088 and basically just amplifies the signal from from Q2. Um, so that the um, it can power the LED. If you just if you just wire the LED straight up to it, it's it's the the voltage isn't great enough to actually make the LED um, pulse. So yeah, you have to add the two N five O double eight. So you can see that I've got that on my board there. I've just done it on Vero because it's basically just two resistors and a uh, and that transistor. And um, yeah, you just wire it up as you normally do with LEDs, so that when you turn the I've wired it up so when I turn the circuit on, the LED comes on and it flashes with the timing. Then you switch it off and the LED cuts out. So I'll do a sound demo now and uh, I'll also demonstrate the ticking so you can hear um, the, the ticking. But just take note that the um, amp's going to be up pretty loud to be able to actually hear the ticking. It's not, it's not, an, it's not a, a loud amount of um, ticking but it's definitely there and it would make it pretty much useless for... Um, for recording as I said earlier. So here we go, I'll just play some slow chords and, um, and just to demonstrate how the tremolo sounds. Thank you. 